It is time for Ishida to go. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to day 28 of the Tournament of Fiction. And today we still have four matches. It's going to keep being like this for a while, so get used to it. But anyways, let's go ahead and get right into the matches. So with the first match, we do have GT Goku versus Ishida of Bleach. For the second match, we have Broly from Dragon Ball Super versus Reiner of Attack on Titan. For the third match, we have Lamillion of My Hero Academia versus Kefla of Dragon Ball Super. And with the main event, we do have Super Boo versus Sasuke the Last. And with that being said, let's get right into it. It is time for Ishida to go. It really is. I'm sick of him. Goku, that's the problem, range. If you give Ishida just a bit of range, that's gonna happen. And he's gonna mm, see if this was Kaido, this probably wouldn't be happening right now. All right, so if Goku, Goku can stop bouncing back from him. He probably will have a chance to. Oh my gosh, she is so annoying. This is he he. I wouldn't say he fights like this, but he fights like this at the same time while also not being toxic in the show. Like he, she is so goaded, bro. But the way they're portraying him, he went Super Saiyan too. Well, Goku, uh, flexing your... Oh. Oh, my gosh. If he goes for his clip. Oh, my gosh. You're just flexing transformations and doing nothing with them. <sighs> he ended this man so fast, bro. And it's not even funny. He flexed three transformations and did absolutely nothing with him. See, when he first transformed to Super Saiyan 2, he had a chance. He had a chance to actually take him down. Yeah, Ishida has to go against somebody that just want, just, just will blitz him. I need I need a Aizen. I need a Aizen to take him down. Because this, this is annoying. This is, oh my gosh, this is actually annoying. Yeah, and Goku's just not it, man. He's... If Goku could just keep jumping and just spamming key blasts, he can actually win, but he didn't do that. <sighs> Alright, so we got Reiner versus Dragon Ball Super Broly. How is this going to work? I honestly could not tell you how. Well, now I can because Broly is actually tearing him apart right now. Okay, Broly is in he's in his Louis V. Duffy right now. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay, so I know all the Dragon Ball fans are rooting for Broly. I know probably half of the people watching this video are rooting for Broly right now. But I feel like it's Attack on Titan season right now. Cause uh Reiner is actually showing out right now. Oh, 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 oh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Broly said, hold up, hold up. This is actually a good fight because they both do a lot of damage. But I think Broly might take this first round maybe maybe yeah he's definitely gonna take the first round yeah all right yep broly's taking the first round wait a whoa whoa how did he get the hit in boom okay so broly broly read up on um he read up on reiner 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 was reiner was scaring me for a second i thought reiner was gonna win for a second but you know things happen so let's see what happens in the second round. Broly got the first hit, and usually the character that gets the first hit is most likely going to win. But, ooh, the tables have turned quickly. Oh my gosh, look at that damage. And he's not even using his, he's not using his ultimate yet. If he does this with straight hands. Oh, yep, he went armored. He went armored. Yep, Broly, there's nothing you can do about that. Don't even try whoa Reiner actually oh my god okay now this is interesting this is actually an interesting battle and wait dang he did that much damage already whoa Reiner Reiner's kind of powerful isn't he I know he's an op and everything but oh he's using a gigantic meteor oh that might do that might leave a mark that might leave a massive mark. Yikes. Yeah, Reiner, you might have just folded. I don't know, because Reiner does a lot of damage, too. And he has he has level 3. He has a level 3. What you going to do? No way. 
No way. Okay. It's it's really down to who can get a super move off first. Broly's trying to blit. What? What? That is crazy. All right. So we have Lamillion versus Kefla. Uh, I don't know. I don't know about this one. Now, it's a possibility that Lamillion can win. Do I think he's going to win? Absolutely not. And this is a prime example of why. Because he's already selling. Kefla does a lot of damage. Oh my gosh, my eyes. Look at, like, I, I, I just, I just don't, I don't, I don't see it. I, I don't see it. I honestly don't see it. Oh my gosh, Kefla. Oof. Wait a minute. My eyes. Oh, 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 my eyes. See, these Dragon Ball characters, they remind me of uh, one of those uh, Kodak flash cameras. Um, when you take a picture with the flash on in the dark, you're like that one guy in a picture with his eyes closed because you're trying to blink because the flash is just so, so, so bright. Oh, Lamillion, what? Okay. Okay. People are trying to prove me wrong today. Uh, okay. All right, so Lamillion took the first round. Uh, totally unexpected. Kefla still hasn't transformed. I don't think she's ever going to transform. She only transformed, what, maybe once in this tournament? Maybe I lied. I definitely lied. And she's gonna do something. Wow, he knocked out her old. I could have sworn she was from there. I think she was from the end. It she definitely was from the end. It or they were from the end. It gotta remember Kefla's two people. Um, <laughs> she was definitely from the end of the match. Ooh, wait a minute. All right, yeah, Kefla, you need to, uh, you gotta. You, you you gotta fight back broly just lost and you're finna lose now uh yeah you need to uh, you need to get it together all right goku done lost I, I don't know who to believe in anymore because this is actually there you go because um how many dragon ball characters love i mean we got beers um i really can't remember any other dragon ball characters that are left i think we just got kefla and beers left oh super boo yeah that's the next match yeah, so we don't have many Dragon Ball characters left. So you 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 have to win. You definitely have to win because the Dragon Ball characters have been going outside. Jiren also won. I forgot about Jiren. He did be Shadow. Mm, there's a tad bit of you guys left. Still, you need to win. But it looks like they're gonna win. Cause that uh that first and second round had me uh had me kind of concerned. Thought they were gonna lose for a second, but I really do. Yeah, like I said. I don't well, wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute fight back first okay yeah Lamillion lost like I said so we got Super Boo versus Sirs I almost said Sirske <laughs> versus Sasuke the last guys you can tell I'm very tired but anyways Boo got the first hands in um who's gonna win this match I don't know this this this, this Mugen tournament has been very unpredictable at this point and it's just hard to tell who's going to win nowadays. I'm just glad Data is gone. Now, if we can get rid of Ishida and Hashirama, I'll be even happier. Because those two are the most spammiest, disgusting characters in this Mugen. Oh, my gosh. I, characters are good. Don't get me wrong. But, golly, bro. The spam. Spamming bombs. Spamming arrows. Spamming trees. Just spam fest galore oh sasuke you got your armor broken in you buddy wait a minute this is actually a good match while i'm over here talking my ass off um okay this is actually evenly matched right now whoa he tried to do onyx jewelry with the teleportation and it did not work he got countered okay this is crazy this is crazy well well wait a minute but wait wait okay okay sasuke wait a minute Oh, wait a minute. Bro, I honestly do not know who can win this match. Okay, he won the first round. All right, so who's actually going to win this match? That that That's the ultimate question for me. Who's actually going to win this match? 
because um, that was actually a very close first round. Okay, Sasuke is blocking like crazy. All right, so Super Boo. Kamikaze attack, something. Sasuke is actually in his Louis V. Duffy. He's in his Birkin right now. Okay, okay, Sasuke. I see, I see, I see. Now, this Sasuke was showing signs of being very, very weak, but uh, I'll, I just out of nowhere, he's just some almighty powerful person now. Because I swear against Kaguya, he was terrible. Against Killua, he should have lost. Now he's just looking like a, a goat. Uh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Boo's trying to make a comeback. I don't think that's happening. He actually got... If he loses right now, he's actually he actually got toasted. Ooh, good ability right there. Good ability. Like that. That, guys, is going to do for day 28 of the Tournament of Fiction. We actually had a pretty decent day. The first match was so annoying. I hope Ishida loses. But I'm not going to talk. We're not going to talk about that. Let's go ahead and go over the winners and losers. And uh, be go just be done with this. Just be done with this. Because if I think about that first match, oh my gosh. Just let's. Let's just be done. So with the first match, we had GT Goku versus Ishida. And Ishida ended up taking a dub, sadly. And with the second match, we had Broly from Dragon Ball Super versus Reiner. And Reiner somehow took the W against Broly, which is just, it's weird. It is weird. With the third match, we had Lamillion versus Kefla. And Kefla ended up taking a dub, which I kind of knew. And with the main event, we had Super Boo versus Sasuke the Last. And Sasuke the Last surprisingly kind of destroyed Super Boo. But, yeah, guys, that's going to do it for day 28. I hope you guys enjoyed. We will be coming back with some more. But until then, guys, I see you on the next one.